Hey, it's Danielle DeLate for The Buzz. Here at America's Got Talent, we are backstage for the quarterfinals week three live shows, and we're about to talk to all of the contestants and judges. The carpet is about to start right now. Hi, Buzz. Hello. Hi, Buzz. <laughs> we had a lot of singers on this evening. Who was your favorite? Of the singers? Mm -hmm. Journey. Journey was amazing. That kid is like, it was like when you, um, uh, you're too young for this, but the first time you saw Michael Jackson on uh, the Ed Sullivan show, you know, you said this was a superstar, a star in the making. I feel like that was a moment where this nine-year-old kid, not only did he make uh, Bob Marley's song his own, but he's an amazing writer, so deep. He's got so, it's so beyond his years. It was a wow moment for me. Yeah, he's absolutely incredible. By the way, with Dee Dee, uh, she was singing a song by Teddy Swims. I know, and I said jelly roll. So I made a mistake. You want to point that out? I did make a mistake. I'm sorry, Teddy. I'm sorry, Teddy. I was just, uh, you know what it was? I think it was the fact that I know it's Teddy. So Teddy was on my, on my podcast, but jelly roll was in jail. So do you see how I got it mixed up? I <laughs> did. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Oh, how are you? <laughs> Good, thank you. Well, tonight was all about the singers. It was all about the singers. Uh, it was all about the kids also. I feel like it was a night full of kids that were so talented. Uh, Journey, I think, was one of my favorite. I think that guy, that kid is going to do really well in the in the overall uh, competition. I mean, it was amazing. It was fantastic. The song, the way he performed was so natural. It was great. Oh, he's a phenomenal yes. talent. Yes. Talent. Yeah. Uh, I've got to ask you about uh, Jelly Boy the Clown. What was it like being so close to that? It was unnecessary. I never like understand why does these things usually happen right in front of us. It's like why can't the camera capture them from over there? It's really disturbing because you know these people are really sticking things in their throats, sharp things. So it's not that um, cute up close. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. you. Lovely to see you too. What was it about Dee Dee's performance that made you push that golden buzzer this evening? I just love Dee Dee. I love her voice. I also love her story, where she comes from and what she does for a living. Like this is, you know, this is her hobby. She not, she's not a professional singer and she has the best voice to me. I mean, it's so like yummy and deep and strong and she has power and she has a range, you know? And my stomach was talking. Like I always go with my gut and it was talking and it was saying Dee Dee all the way. What was the energy like when you pressed that golden buzzer, then you went up on stage, took your shoes off? Because she is, I don't know, I was just happy for it. It's just such a happy moment when you see someone on the stage and they're kind of like, they're crying, like all their emotions and feelings are just like letting loose. So I was part of that emotion with her, you know? Yeah, it was incredible. We could feel that through the TV yeah, as well. No, yeah. she's, she's lovely. She's everything. Now we're going to talk about the last act, the clown. Yes. What was it like being that close while he was putting the saw down his... I know, it's kind of gross, but you kind of cannot look away. Mm -hmm. And also, I don't know, this is an art, so I respect also the art that he does. Like, we all can't do that, mm -hmm. you know? So I think we have to also see it from that. You know, he makes it all like a show, but it's also an art that you can swallow this whole sword. I could have done without the peanut butter on it because that's kind of a little bit like... And I was worried that it was going to spit over onto me, so I'm sorry, Howie, I had to sit on Howie for a hot second. <laughs> Um, but I, I, it kind of overcame, you know, because I was like, I don't want to be spat on because that, like, I would get like a herpes on my mouth tomorrow. Like literally, that grosses me out. It would be immediately itching, and I would get like a thing. <laughs> yeah, you know. Well, I guess that's what AGT is all about. All these different acts, this yeah. craziness, and it's up. It is, always, it is always a roller coaster ride of emotions. Yes. Yeah. 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 It was a great evening this evening. I feel like it was all about the singers. It was all about the singers tonight. I think it was just one of those nights. Um, and I think, the, uh, I mean, obviously the girl who, you know, Dina, who got the golden buzzer, she was amazing. Journey, that little kid, he's so sweet. Um, he's got such a great personality. Um, that was good. Um, so, yeah, that's what it was all about tonight. You're right. This is Simon, and once again, I've been buzzed in a good way. Oh, that's what we Yeah, yeah. I also got the sword up 